victory celebration is at every turn in Winnipeg, and it has nothing to do with the score of the Winnipeg Jets' first regular season game. It has everything to do with the return of the game itself. Brings back the joy to Winnipeg. It's been this song that we haven't had a team, and I mean, you look around and the fans, and it's just unbelievable to be here and be part of this experience, and it's great. For hockey fans and for Winnipeggers, this is more than just the first regular season home game. This is a resurrection, resurrection of the hockey spirit that they lost so many years ago. Go Jets, go! Over 15,000 fans packed the MTS Center to watch hockey history as the Jets took on Montreal, a game fans have waited for for over 15 years. It was like a family member leaving, and now, and now they're coming back. It's like, uh, yeah, resurrection. A fact not lost on the team's owner, who struggled to describe his emotions before puck drop. It's uh, obviously uh, an outpouring of, a, of emotion that's probably been uh, many years coming. For the select thousands who got their hands on game tickets. Paper gold. Seeing the Jets fly again is a dream come true. It's priceless. You can't even explain it. I said I couldn't sleep last night. It seemed like Christmas. Unbelievable. This is probably one of the best experiences anybody could have in a lifetime. Just fantastic. Go Jets go! Go Jets go! Go Jets go! And there's no shortage of fanfare or emotions outside the arena either. Tears are a common sight. I've been shedding tears for the last three months. It's, it's unbelievable. Go Jets go! Go Jets go! The event has drawn fans from across North America. The Forks in downtown Winnipeg is ground zero for tens of thousands of revelers. This Don Cherry impersonator came in from Calgary. I flew in on my own dime just to mingle with the people and have some fun. You know, it's a great event. I wouldn't want to miss it. At every turn, there's a cheer and even an embrace. Because the return of the Jets marks the end of one dream realized and the start of many new ones. If he was here, then he, he got to be here from the beginning and to, to the future. One day maybe he'll be a hockey player. <laughs> Nicole Dubay, Sun News, Winnipeg.